Let's do a clash check between this structural and this MEP model. We'll come here to clash sets, create a new clash check report. We'll give it a name. We're going to specify the type of clashes to be clash only versus clearance. We'll set a tolerance here to be an eighth of an inch. We're going to ignore any clashes that are within the same file. We're only looking for clashes between the two different files. And then we could assign this clash report if we'd like to. I'm just going to press submit. And now the clash checking is going to be evaluated in the background. We'll now review the clash sets created by me. We'll select structural and MEP. And then you'll see the clashes highlighted in the model. Over here on the right, we can see in the details that there are a total of 12 clashes. If we go to the individual clashes, as you hover over each one of these different clashes in the list, you'll see that clash highlighted in the model. When you select on the clash, it will zoom you into that particular location and then hide the other objects.